we prepare about two months for this challenge. And the most challenging point is in the first mission, our robot have to go straight and turn about 90 degrees. It's not very accurate. Every time there's many difference. So. The biggest challenge I faced is probably getting the team to work together because they argue a lot because uh, each person has a different idea of thinking. So let's say Yash has, wants to do something, but Shingy disagrees. How did you guys overcome this difficulty? We, we voted on whose idea is better. We're hosting the ECMAS Commission South Regional this year with 18 four different schools, around 50 coaches and students joining this competition this year. In the FLL Competition Challenge, uh, it has four components, robot game, robot design, innovation project, and core value. Our team is called the CIS Grizzlies, and we have five members, which is Kevin, who did the design, the Maple Leaf, and the CIS DZ. Thing. And then I made the DNA. It looked pretty good. And yeah, will be the idea man who thinks of lots of ideas to help our team to upgrade. And Liam will be the innovation captain. I am the team captain. I will do everything a bit. And singing is coding. And I'll go to get number one. teams competing for this competition today and we are in the South Regional Competition. I'm so proud of how they did for the training and how they present to the judges today. For the presentation, it's about robot design and the core value. We are focusing that uh, for students to practice their engineering design mindset and their robot design and how to program to finish the mission in the, in the robot game. As you can see, the first ones have a large space which can cause it to go through some path that might be very hard. But for the second one, you have a smaller space and a more effective way to have a mission being going on. But I think the second one is actually better than the first one. In this project, we have learned about the package. And for the second thing, like we learned is about the coronavirus. It also can help us to know about the coronavirus and how we can sanitize the coronavirus with with zero touching and... I learned how to uh, get better teamwork and I learned how to talk, like, to agree on things better. And I also learned how to uh, design prototypes. Because I can tell they're nervous at the beginning and after that, when we turn on the video call with the judges and they become excited and it's time to showcase their uh, effort for this project. I'm glad to see they prepare so well and I'm proud of their presentation today. 